Waking up feeling like it's gone away Hello guys I've decided that today I'm going to do a massive closet clean out So that's what this video is going to be The other day I had a complete breakdown because I was trying to like make some outfits And none of the clothes that I actually have in my closet fit me uh, and that's just something that comes with age and I'm fully accepting of that that you're just gonna you're not gonna fit into the clothes that you had when you were 16 years old and I've been holding on to these pieces of clothing thinking that one day I'm gonna use them again but I don't think that's the case and it's time to let go and make some space for new pieces of clothing that I feel comfortable in so yeah that's what I'm doing today I'll show you guys the state of my closet currently this right here is my wardrobe. My dad actually built it for me. What a gem. I kind of drew a vision of what I wanted the wardrobe to be because I wanted it in this corner with that wall and my dad made it happen. And so yeah, he like fully built this himself. We got all the materials from Bunnings and we made it happen. But yeah, this side is my casual pieces of clothing. As you can see, I really love to color coordinate. And then on this side, Way too colourful for my liking. This half is my work clothing. And then this is where all my colourful pieces of clothing are that I don't want to put on the aesthetic side over there. I've got a bunch of clothing that I've probably just shoved in there. And then down here, I'm so scared to show you guys, but this is all my shoes. This box holds like my bathers, um, my socks, my undergarments. And then up here I just have like my miscellaneous items. And then over here I've got my clothing rack. This is normally in my office, which is in the next room. On this clothing rack I like to keep my new pieces that I want to make outfits out of. And then finally I have this Ikea drawer here. The first drawer. As you can see, I like to fold my clothing. I kind of Marie Kondo it. This here is work bottoms. And then in the second drawer, this is like my casual bottoms. And then down here is like my pajamas and my gym wear. Okay, so I have no idea where to start. So I'm just gonna pull out everything from the closet and dump it on my bed. <laughs> That is actually so many clothes. Who knew? And I still haven't even touched the wardrobe. As you can see, this is all empty now. So I'm gonna sort through everything I have here. I'm going to make a keep pile and then a donate or sell pile. So, so this jumper right here, for example, I don't wear it, but I wanna keep it because it's from Korea. It's very nostalgic. I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna keep it for now. Oh, hello, Papa. Like, I don't see myself ever wearing this, but it's so cool. This was gifted to me, um, and I believe it's from like China. I'm gonna keep it. Is that bad? <laughs> that is crazy. This is a kukai dress. It's actually very flattering for like your figure, but I'm never gonna wear this. This dress is cute, but I don't feel like myself wearing it. This skirt is like a really old school meshki set. There's like a top, oh here it is. A matching bralette to it. I wore this for my 19th birthday and I still have it. This is from 2008, that's my year 7 jumper and then I also have this blazer from year 12 and I don't want to get rid of them just yet. I feel like this is memorabilia almost so I will still hold on to them. I don't think that's bad right? I think that's like a memory thing. I love to hold on to memories so I'm gonna keep those ones. I have an appointment so I'll have to continue all of this when I get back. I'm back, I stopped by Kmart to get some containers for like my undergarments and stuff so I'll use that later. The bed is officially clear of clothing, it's just left with all the hangers. That's a decent amount. So this is everything that I'm giving away or selling. 
gonna get rid of all these random hangers and then I've just got these black ones left. This is how the final wardrobe has turned out. I've color coordinated everything. There's now a lot more room to like move the hangers, which is really good. I've literally removed my mirrors so that you can see the full view of the closet. But now I have to tackle the drawers. I uber eated some sushi, which I think it's here. It says zero minutes away, but I haven't got a no gotten a notification. Sushi break. About everything. So I'm gonna get rid of things that don't really. I am re-energized after my sushi, so I'm gonna do these drawers. Tight, tiny as way too small as well never reach for them I just don't think I'll wear this just not my style anymore too big way too tight okay so I'm done with the drawers and guys I have no clothes in here this is completely empty these are my work bottoms I definitely need to invest into more I can't even like Marie Kondo it because it's empty so that's that one this one's completely empty Okay, now I'm doing the bottom of the wardrobe. So I've just got random miscellaneous stuff here. This is where I said I had all my undergarments and then all my shoes. I'm gonna first do the top half and then move on to the bottom half. I just emptied everything out and I'm gonna put these containers that I got from Ikea. Ikea? Kmart. I got these from Kmart. These are collapsible storage cubes. And then I got these two plastic containers. So bikinis, hats, belts, accessories, socks, and then my underwear. Waking up feeling like it's gone away. It's sunny up, but it just comes in. Okay, away. this is what it's looking like now. Don't mind my sock drawer. I don't know where all my socks are. I'm gonna do the shoes now. Oh my goodness. I do not know. Okay, so this is as good as the shoes are gonna get. I'm actually gonna sell these two and then I'm gonna donate all of these in here. Not too bad so far. Um, I might just quickly tidy up the top and then I'll put back the mirrors. <laughs> this is like my memories box. My nephew wrote this one to me. I have to keep that one. These are my study notes from year 12, I reckon. This is an old iPod. I'm keeping that. Hawaii. Every single award that I received in high school. All things Ata. I've kept all of our travel itineraries in here. And one thing I've been collecting is our name placements at weddings. Oops. Games. This is my drawing of Twiggy. It's very old. It's literally ripping. Got my church notes in here. This one says, Joy doesn't have to be the absence of sadness or the presence of the spectacular. Appreciate what is now. The only way you can affect your future is in the present. Traveling, 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 traveling hat, and traveling. And that's the final look of my wardrobe. I'm gonna put the mirrors back now because they've just been sitting here for the longest time. We are almost done. This is everything that I'm giving away. It's actually a lot. I'm gonna put the sell pile here and then the donate pile over here. Waking up feeling like it's gone away. Okay, I finally packed everything. This is all going to the salvos. And then I'm going to sell these three shoes. And there's probably like four pieces of clothing in here that I feel like are worthy of selling. I'm almost done. I just have these pieces of clothing that I was gonna give away, but I'm thinking I could salvage them if I kind of cut them up a bit. So I'm gonna see if I can flip them. And by flip, I mean just cut them. So the first piece is this dress. You could probably see that it's a dress in the mirror. But the reason why I'm not gonna keep this is because I feel 
very uncomfortable in it. It's just very like fitting and the material is really thin so you can see like underwear lines and stuff. So what I would rather do is make this a top. Okay, I just cut it as you can see and I already love it. Now I can actually wear it because it's just been sitting in my closet for the last two or three years. Next is this dress, same thing, it's a bit too tight. I just don't see myself wearing it as a dress, so I'm gonna make it a top. Achoo! Sorry, um, but here's the top, I love it. I will definitely be using this a lot more. Okay, so this, plus this broken sleeve, is the next dress. Um, it's very short, it doesn't even zip up at the back, so I'm not even going to bother trying to flip it. It is currently 10, 11 p.m. I'm officially done. I just took some photos on Depop of these items right here. So, yeah, these items here I am selling, plus the two shoes down there. I feel like a huge weight has been lifted off my shoulders, even though I'm so exhausted. But I was holding on to a lot of clothes from my teenage years so I feel great and I'm excited to revamp my entire closet one day. I'm gonna go drop off the bags to the salvos. They've got like these bins that I can put them in but before I do that I'm just gonna close out the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed watching me entirely clean out my closet. I definitely think there's a bunch more that I could get rid of but um, I think I'm gonna go thrift shopping next week so that I can get those pieces that I know I will wear um, and then kind of replace them with the old ones that I have in here. So yes, yeah, stay tuned for next week's video. I'll do a thrift with me. But until then, I hope you have an amazing week and thank you for watching my video.